Hello. Today I'm going to take you through the unboxing and installation of your Perilynx Analyzer. Please watch the following setup to assist with your installation.
Select Adjust Settings on the main screen. Select the date and time and adjust accordingly. Select Auto Print on. Press back to the main menu. QSET Quality Control. For initial QSET setup or replacement QSET. From the main menu, select Adjust Settings and then QSET Setup. Enter your user ID either using the touchscreen or the barcode scanner with your ID badge. Press Next. Enter the Perilinx QSET serial number. Press Next. Insert the Perilinx QSET when prompted. Press Next. The results will be displayed and printed in 10 minutes. The result should say Setup Complete. Place the printed label in your record keeping book. Running a daily QSET quality control. Select Run QSET QC from the main menu. Enter your user ID via the touch screen or using the barcode scanner with your ID badge. Press Next. Confirm the QSET number matches that of your blue QSET. If this is different, you will have to return to the main menu, select Adjust Settings and run a QSET setup prior to running your daily QSET quality control. Press Next. Insert the Perilinx QSET when prompted. Press Next. The end time will be displayed whilst analysing. The result will be displayed and printed in three minutes. Please note, the daily QC should be performed every 24 hours or prior to patient testing. The date and time of when the last QSET was performed will be displayed on the main menu screen. Calibrating a new box of cassettes. Calibration must be set when changing cassette lots. From the main menu, select Enter New Calibration Code. Enter your user ID, press Next. Use the barcode scanner to enter the cassette lot number, which can be found on the side of the cassette box. You can also enter this manually using the touch screen. Press Next. Use the barcode scanner to enter the calibration code, which can also be found on the side of the cassette box. This can also be entered manually. Press Next. A system calibrated label will be printed. Place printed label in your record keeping book. Running the Liquid Controls QC. The Liquid Controls are performed once per cassette shipment or change in lot number. Please note, Liquid Controls should be kept in the refrigerator and expire six months after opening. Liquid Controls must come to room temperature before being run. From the main menu screen, Select Run Liquid QC. Enter your user ID. Press Next. Enter the cassette lot number, either using the barcode scanner or manually. Press Next. Select Level 1. And press Next. Enter the control lot number which can be found on the box of your liquid controls or on the vial label. Press Next. Enter the cassette into the analyzer. Draw up 200 microliters of your control with your pipette and syringe.
When you are ready, press Next. When prompted, pipette exactly 200 microliters of the control into the cassette. And then press Start Test. When result has been printed, please refer to the control box for the result range. Press Finish. Select Level 2 and repeat the previous steps using a new cassette and your Level 2 liquid control. When you have your Level 2 sample ready, press Next. And then press Start Test. Place the printed labels in your record keeping books. You can also print duplicate labels to attach to the cassette boxes themselves. For additional support, please visit www.hologic.com forward slash support.